Hi, so uh, my name is Jer. Uh, Cole. Paul? Paul, right? Yeah. Okay. Cole. Uh, what's your name? Cole. Nico. Cole? Nico? And. I'm Brandon. Hey, nice to meet you. So, um, and here's the girls, you know, just hanging out. So, we just wanted to ask you what your opinions are of an afterlife, and you guys can join in, you know. Of afterlife? You want, yeah. you want my opinion on afterlife? Yeah. What I think so ha what happens when you die is. To be honest with you, nothing. Nothing? Nothing. I think you just die and then that's it. Oh, okay. That's, so that's my opinion. Okay. If big if, if there is a heaven, you think you who do you think would go there? Who do I think would go to heaven? Yeah. If there is a heaven. I mean, I guess people that deserve to go to heaven, people that have done right in their life that deserve that. A good go person, to probably. A good person, yeah. Oh, okay. Um, would you consider yourself to be a good person? Uh, yeah, for the most part, yeah. yeah. Uh, okay, can I ask you a few questions to see if that's true? Okay. Um, have you ever lied? Yeah. Okay, what do you call someone who lies? What? What do you call someone a who lies? A bad person, I guess. Well, no, specifically. A, a liar. A liar, guess. okay. A liar, yeah. Have you ever stolen anything? Uh, no. Okay, have you borrowed anything with, with forgetting to ask, maybe? Yeah. Okay. That. Can you do that at the bank? Yeah, you can do that at the bank, yeah. No, like borrow without asking? No, you can't you can't borrow. Yeah. The the oh no, I have no I have no okay no. You know I, what I'm saying? If wrong. you need yeah, money yeah. you want to, you know what I mean? If you needed money, you can't do that at the bank. Yeah, yeah. You got you gotta really inform someone. If the money that. was just hanging there, you can't just grab it and then walk out and say, I I'll thought, pay you back. I thought what you were saying is that somebody gave me something and then yeah. I forgot to give it back. Well, oh no no. Like you know, without asking permission yeah. first. Um, maybe when I was younger, yeah. Sure. You know, some people say they've taken candy out of the cookie jar or whatever, yeah. you know. Yeah. Whatever, it doesn't matter what the cost is, right? What do you call someone who steals things? A stealer. A thief. Stealer's a football team. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay, so, so, um, one more thing. Have you ever, um, have you ever murdered anyone? I hope not. Uh, no, I have not. Okay, good. <laughs> okay. Um, do you think murder is a bad thing? Probably someone yeah. who murdered someone yeah, wouldn't probably. go to heaven, right? Yeah, probably, yeah. It's okay. a bad thing, but it could be a good thing. You never know. Well. Like, let's say... <laughs> let's... <laughs> Give me one reason why okay. murdering let's would get, be a good get thing. This. Somebody gets, like, a disease. A disease that could kill the whole world. Yeah, and the only way to cure the disease is to kill that person. Then, wouldn't that be a good... Wouldn't that be... Wouldn't that be a good thing? Wouldn't it be doing a good thing? Because you'd be saving millions of more lives. Well, there's a difference between murder and killing. Y yeah, you're right. Y you know what I mean? Yeah, okay, yeah. So, it's just it's suggesting okay. that the murder, murder is like wrong. an illegal yeah. killing, right? Yeah. So, um, well, I and you said you didn't, and that's good. But Jesus said whoever hated a brother or anyone else without any, any reason is a murderer. So, have you ever hated anyone? Oh, yeah. Yeah, I've hated people before, yeah, yeah, you've probably been pissed off just like the rest of us with someone, right? Yeah. And if you think about it, where does murder begin? Before you even act on someone, you've hated someone, right? Yeah. So it makes sense. Okay, just based on those three things, if, if you were to die today, and I hope that doesn't happen, and you were to face, um, face God, do you think you're guilty or innocent before Him? Based on those three things. Well, now... Right now, maybe when I was younger, I wouldn't, I wouldn't, but now I think I would. You I, would? Yeah. Okay. Heaven or hell? Heaven. Why heaven? Well, because I was really troubled youth, I guess. Okay. So, and now I've gotten way better and stuff, and now I'm working on getting a job and all that. So. Well, that's good, but try to take that in the court of law, okay? If you broke the law in, in, in Winnipeg and you go to court for it, you know, Tell that to a judge. Well, if we're talking about God, then God forgives our sins no matter what, does he not? Well, no think about it, it this way. There's a hell for a reason. Mm -hmm. yeah, okay? That's true, yeah. Okay, so it doesn't make sense, right? If Why should we live a good life if, you know, if it doesn't matter, really, if everyone goes to heaven, right? Yeah, that's true. Okay, so um, look at it this way. If you go to court right now and you say, you know, it's true, I, I did all those crimes, but I'm a good person. I, I do other good, I do more good things than I did bad. Would a judge in Winnipeg say, "Oh, okay, you're free off the hook"? 
Probably not. It doesn't matter because you, it's yeah. you still did the bad things, right? Mm -hmm. Okay. So, does that concern you if, if God were to if you were to if you were to die and God would send you to hell? Does it concern you? Why not? Well, because like no matter what, no matter what, I was always told when I was a kid that Jesus will forgive our sins if if we ask for forgiveness. He'll forgive us. Yeah, but try that in the court of law. In the court know? of law, then yeah, that, then yeah, I would be, I would be worried. Yeah. You know, you, you say, judge, can you? I'm sorry. Mm -hmm. That doesn't work, right? No, it doesn't, it doesn't no, work. So, not all the time. okay, so this is the this is the point I'm making. Um, do you know what God did so you don't have? Because I don't want you to go to jail. I, I really care about you. Do I we know care about God you did? guys. You know, um, we don't want you to go there. That's why we are talking to you. Uh, we're strangers. I know this is a weird interview, but. You know, we really care about you. You know, we're not telling you to give us money or nothing. We're just, we really care about you. So, do you know what God did so you don't, you a guilty Jesus. sinner can go to, to heaven? Jesus Christ? Yes. Jesus Christ, he, he, told, he um, got crucified for all of our sins. There you go. You know that part. But maybe you don't understand the legal reasons or implications for that. Do you know the no, legal not exactly, things? No. This is what happened legally, okay? In God's court of law. We did the crime, Jesus paid for our fines, for our crimes. Mm. We don't have the money to pay off God to be set free, but Jesus does because He lived an innocent life. Only He can pay for our crimes against God. Sorry, I just gotta interject. We actually gotta get going to this okay. appointment now. Okay, well, thank you for the interview. Thank you. I, I, I really, thank you. Uh, could you give them a gospel track? Oh, you guys, are, you guys are on YouTube, so I can go look this up. Yeah, yeah, I'll... I'll, I'll um, yeah, you know what? Yeah. I, I did want to tell you to take advantage of what God did for you. You got to repent and trust Jesus alone, okay? Okay, I think it is this one right here. Okay. Cool, cool. Appreciate it, bros. Thanks for your time, guys. Really appreciate it. Take care, man. God bless you.